There's a cool little option in the Cinema 4D Release 17 take system that will dramatically speed up your workflow as you're building takes, and that is this button called Lock Overrides. What it does is it basically inverts the take system. Say for instance I've decided that I want my text to be aligned on the left hand side rather than the middle, and I want that to be the case in all takes. Well right now I can't edit that because I'm in a sub take and it's grayed out. So I could go back to my main take and change the attribute there, but it's a lot quicker if I'm still here in a sub take to just turn off lock overrides and now all of the attributes that are overridden are grayed out and the ones that are global are available to change. So I can go in here to my align and just change it to align left. And that's going to apply universally throughout all of the takes. And then when I'm ready to go back to editing just my specific takes, I can hit the lock overrides button again. So this is a quick way to jump back into the global level and make global changes while you're still editing a specific take. Now of course the button is still a little bit tedious to work with and so what I would recommend doing is either using the commander shift C and just typing lock over uh, and finding the lock overrides command or uh, even better go into your command manager find lock overrides here and go ahead and create a shortcut maybe control shift L and we'll go ahead and assign that and now I can simply hit control shift L, lock overrides on, control shift L, lock overrides off. So that is the lock overrides option in the Cinema 4D release take system which provides a quick way to affect the global attributes of the scene while you're still in a specific active take.